Last episode, we talked about fuel additives that will protect your engine and fuel from freezing cold temps. In today's Amzilla Garage episode, we're gonna cover additives that can affect your diesel engine's power and efficiency. Hey guys, I'm Greg Jones for Engine Builder, and today we're talking about two things all diesel fanatics can appreciate, power and efficiency. To make the most of those two engine elements, we need to call on the help of fuel additives. Maximizing power and engine efficiency can only be achieved through the highest quality fuel and burning every atomized drop of fuel that you spray through the injector. That's the key, trying to burn every droplet of fuel that you spray in cylinder, not out the exhaust valve and in the pipe. The more you can burn in cylinder, the more power you will make. One way you can do that is through higher cetane fuel. With low cetane fuels, you're probably not going to burn every atom that you spray in cylinder. With higher cetane fuels, you have a better chance of burning more of that fuel in cylinder. You'll likely feel the truck start faster or smoke less or feel like it has more power. That's because the engine is burning more fuel in cylinder and producing power. It's less waste out the pipe and more burning in cylinder. Cetane improvers are great for helping produce less smoke better starting, and more felt power. Again, it's improving the efficiency of the burn of those fuel droplets in cylinder. The other chemistry you can use to affect power and engine efficiency are detergents. Because deposits can form in a high pressure common rail system rather quickly, it's important to keep your fuel system clean. When you have really tight clearances, and we're talking two to five microns in an injector, it doesn't take much of a deposit to disrupt the reaction of that pintle when it's supposed to fire somewhere between five and seven times per combustion cycle. If you slow down that pintle, which is the needle inside the injector, you're going to disturb power. With the addition of biodiesel and the way biodiesel is made, that introduces some salt materials and carboxylates that can form on the inside of the injector and rob you from power. Detergents can go in there and make sure everything remains clean. It keeps your injector clean so that there's no delay and no deposits on the nozzle that affect the spray pattern in the cylinder. Detergents are good for keeping your fuel system, which is the rail, the injector, and piston top, free of deposits. Anywhere you can draw deposits will disrupt your fuel burn, which then disrupts your horsepower and efficiency. If you're asking yourself, do I use a cetane improver or a detergent? Well, ideally you want to run both of them because you always want to protect your system from deposit formation. You should do it every tank of fuel too, because you can't provide protection if you only do it every five tanks. Amsoil has products that are a combination of cetane, detergent, and lubricity. They have a product that is just lubricity and detergent if you don't care about cetane. It depends on what you want or what your fuel quality is, and a little bit about what your area's ambient temperatures are, but regardless of temperature, cetane still gives your engine benefits, but it shines with cold starts. The real key is using those additives in every tank of diesel fuel to improve combustion efficiency and to burn all those droplets of fuel you spray in cylinder. Well, that does it for this episode of Amzola Garage. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and we hope to see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching.